So again, I reckon for you, Collingwood at the MCG being a Victorian boy, it doesn't get much bigger than that, does it? Yeah, no, it's right. It's good to. It's always good to play in front of the family and friends, and I'm sure they'll they'll all come along. But it's also very quite like playing at G. It's very wide and very big, so plenty of space to run. And um, I think it's good for us. Good for us playing a couple of big games last year in the finals. There, it gives us a bit of an extra experience. And um, although it's our first game at the G this year, we we're very confident with how we'll go, and um, we're hoping to. Put up a best effort, and we expect Collingwood to play somewhere towards their best. You might go back to the final last year, obviously that day you had qualified final. Oh yeah, I mean it's, it's a, I mean a different season, but I mean we were, we were very happy. Uh, we weren't sort of happy, but we were, we were pretty disappointed with how we went that game. We, and we felt we were a big chance to win that, and probably should have won it. So uh, we go over there with plenty of confidence, knowing how we played against them last year. Um, but also knowing what, what they can do um, when they're on top of the game. Does this feel like a big test though for you? Like a big test so far this season to see how not personally but the team is travelling? Oh, I mean, it's a bit big test sort of ladder, ladder position wise, but um, we take every week very seriously and each, each team very seriously. Um, we feel it's just, just another game in our sort of learning curve in our season just to see how far we've improved. You don't get a lot of games at the G. Um, how much of a disadvantage is that when you get to finals time? Oh, I mean, it's hard to, it's hard to tell, really. Um, I'm not sure how many play, we played there last year in the season, maybe one or two. Um, yeah, I mean, I, it's, it's pretty hard to tell. But obviously it's, a, obviously, it's an advantage for those Melbourne clubs that play there every sort of second week as opposed to interstate clubs. But, well, I mean, we're, we're confident we can play well, play well anywhere. And, um, that's sort of a thing we're striving to become as a team that plays well. Um, doesn't just play well at Patterson Stadium, but plays well at every every ground in the country. Have you noticed you're starting to get players running with you now? I've noticed that uh, you, know, you, used, you used to be able to sneak through a bit, but now they're actually sort of locking really yeah. in on you. Yeah, a little bit sort of um, last sort of few weeks, but I think it's a great thing about our midfielders. We've got so many guys in good form playing well that if someone is on someone and maybe is shut down a little bit, that um, other guys take up the slack and. We don't rely on just sort of um, Curry every week or Matty Prittis. We've got a lot, a lot of options um, of guys that can step up and perform sort of match-winning sort of roles. Is it a new challenge though that you have to work through part of your development, sort of beating the guys <coughs> that are sort of tag? Oh, definitely. It's a great, ex great experience. I mean, you, uh, great learning curve for me. I mean, you can't. I mean, obviously Curry, Curry's been been tagged for several years now, and he's um, because he's just played so well. Um, early in sort of the last couple of years before his injury. So um, you just see, see the performances he does when he isn't tagged, um, sort of against, against Hawthorne early in the season comes to mind. So well, I guess clubs have got to decide which, which one or two to sort of target. How do you feel about your own form? You sort of, you sort of have plenty of the ball. Yeah, I've sort of been reasonably happy with sort of my consistency um, for the year. Obviously there's sort of a few areas, um, like every football, that we want to improve on and get better at. Um, I feel I'm sort of playing my role and doing my bit for the team, just like everyone, sort of everyone else is at the moment. So, uh, yeah, I'm striving, striving to get better in sort of different aspects, but in all in all, sort of been reasonably happy.